Hello, yes, yeah, save Kenya, eh, sorry Kensington, I've got mixed up then, I wonder why. I've been talking to a friend that lives in Kensington, in fact he's lived there most of his life, he's been telling me some stories that are really scary, that Liam Thor, the, the Echo reporter that reported on Kensington, I'll leave his report at the end of this video, conveniently left out. I won't be leaving them out, rest assured. Also, I've got an amazing leaflet uh, for the area. I've designed in my head so far, it's only in my head so far, an excellent leaflet for the area. It'll be bullet points, it'll be straight to the point where the people of Kensington, the forgotten beleaguered white working class, will know exactly what I'm saying. And they'll know exactly what I'm offering, right? Don't forget, it's not Joe Owens. Right, that's caused the problems of Kensington. It's those that are supposed to be governing it, those the people look up to, those the people rely on to uh, be looked after in them areas. And they've been let down, they've been abandoned. They've been abandoned on the altar of multiculturalism and third world immigration. It literally is terrible. And like I've said before, those responsible for this mess should be brought before the courts and put in jail. There's no doubt in my mind. It literally is a dreadful place, especially of a night. I've drove round there of a night and it's like a third world ghetto. It's like somewhere literally in Kenya, trust me it is. There's prostitutes all along uh, Shield Road. You've got kids walking past them, residents walking past them that have to put up with it. What's the local sitting councillor, councillors doing? I don't know. I don't, what's anyone doing? I don't know, but I will do all I can to represent the people of Kent. I will speak out, I won't be silenced. I've got a good campaign and a good campaign team. Just letting you know that Kensington hasn't gone away. I'm still in there looking around them, uh, talking to locals and uh, I'll be running a good campaign there come May 2018. I will definitely be ruffling a few feathers. Okay, thank you.